Welcome to Granny's Book Nook. Today's story is Marco's Cinco de Mayo, written by Lisa Willard, illustrated by Holly Conger. What is Cinco de Mayo? Hi, I'm Marco. See my costume? It's for Cinco de Mayo. That's a holiday that started in Mexico. People there speak Spanish. Cinco de Mayo means the 5th of May in Spanish. Mexico is a neighbor of the United States. Many people have moved from Mexico to live in the United States. Many people in the United States have family members in Mexico. My family is Mexican-American. We celebrate Cinco de Mayo here in the United States, too. My city has a big parade. There are games, carnival rides, music, and dancing. The yummy Mexican food is the best part. Cinco de Mayo celebrations are popular in many U.S. cities. You don't have to be Mexican-American to go. The celebrations in the United States are bigger than most in Mexico. A big problem. This year, I haven't even had one taco. I'm too nervous. I'm one of the dancers. Lots of people are here to watch. What if I forget all the steps? Dancers and other people wear costumes for Cinco de Mayo. The costumes are based on different times and places in Mexico's history. There's my cousin Diego. He's the one who taught me this dance. Last night, Diego told me a story. He said it would help if I felt afraid. Brave and proud. Diego told me about the first Cinco de Mayo. It happened about 150 years ago. France sent many soldiers to Mexico to start a war. People thought the French soldiers were the best in the world. Spain ruled Mexico for hundreds of years. The Mexicans fought a war to be free from Spain from 1810 to 1821. When the French soldiers came in 1861, the Mexicans got worried. They did not want to lose their freedom again. The Mexican army was small, but the Mexicans were brave and proud of their country. On May 5, 1862, they did something surprising. They won a big battle against the French soldiers. The May 5th battle did not end Mexico's war with France, but the Mexican people remembered Cinco de Mayo. They kept fighting. Finally, they won. I can be brave and proud too. I listen to the mariachi band while I wait to go on stage. Suddenly, my feet are ready to dance. Mariachi music has been popular in Mexico for a long time. Mariachi bands use instruments like violins, guitars, and trumpets. The band members wear fancy costumes. The taco battle. Diego says I did a great job dancing. It sure made me hungry. We have a taco eating battle. I eat two more than Diego. Tacos are made from tortillas wrapped around a filling. Tortillas are Mexican bread. They are flat, thin, and round. Boom! The fireworks flash the colors of the Mexican flag. Cinco de Mayo is almost over. 
but tomorrow I'm going to practice my dancing again. I will be ready to dance again next May 5th. Thank you for visiting Grammy's Book Nook. To get more information for this book, check the description box below. Be sure to thumbs up this video. Click the subscribe button for the latest videos on Grammy's Book Nook.